hello friends welcome back thank you for your support today's video is uh, preparing fish biryani using king fish slices one of my favorite and also the tasty delicious biryani you have to try you will like it for sure and also it's a stages of cooking process it takes for the entire recipe to prepare though it is easy you can surely try so let's begin the recipe the recipe begins with the marinating fish here the fish is already cleaned ready for the marination to marinate add ginger garlic paste chili powder coriander powder turmeric garam masala salt lemon juice so mix well all the spices and coat after marinating after coating the fishes we gonna keep all the fishes for the resting this is how it looks like so after the marination keep the fish slices for at least minimum 30 minutes to 1 hour for the better taste so always when you marinate fish keeping it for some time it adds more taste for the fish after 30 minutes or 1 hour fry fishes in the hot oil you can use the medium flame gently place it in the hot oil cook each side 2 minutes or 3 minutes maximum if you want crispy then you can cook extra 1 or 2 minutes each side so after cooking of uh, both sides remove it keep it aside so this is the best way to cook fish biryani so once the fish fry is done the next is let's go for a biryani masala preparation or gravy preparation add 2 to 3 tablespoon of ghee to bay leaf onion sliced green chili ginger garlic paste fry these all the list of ingredients in the oil or ghee until onion become soft well again it will take 1 uh, to 2 minutes in a medium flame then you can add then you can add turmeric chili powder biryani masala powder you can go for your homemade or you can also buy biryani masala powder from outside supermarket so fry this all until the raw smell goes off which will take again 1 minute so then this is the time to add tomato salt for the tomato to cook so friends mix very well let the tomatoes cook finally so let this cook for another couple of minutes then you can see the gravy is uh, formed kind of biryani gravy and the smells really good so once the gravy is ready keep it aside while preparing the gravy please do not add the water the next is cooking the rice add salt for the water star anise cinnamon stick clove green cardamom so get water boil with the spices for 1 or 2 minute then you can add soaked basmati rice you can use the medium flame to cook the rice friends here we want rice to be cooked 50 percentage of rice to be cooked not fully so when the rice is done like a 50 percentage of the flame remove the rice stain out the water keep the rice aside 
the next is forming the layer after forming the layer we have to keep the biryani with the fishes for the steaming for at least minimum 10 to 15 minutes this is how the setup goes on add a tablespoon of ghee once the ghee is melted spread the rice gently so once the rice is spread you can uh, gently spread the biryani masala then followed by fishes slices which we have already fried place it then next green chilli you can skip it some fresh mint leaf coriander leaf lemon slices some fried onions the saffron soaked milk add enough again the rice you can spread over on the top of the rice again you can spread the saffron soaked milk and some ghee once the layer is done you can close the lid tightly for at least minimum 15 to 20 minutes for the better taste of the biryani so meanwhile let's check out today's motivation if your eyes are positive you will love the world but if your tongue is positive world will love you so friends finally the biryani looks really yummy give it a try you will like it for sure if you like it don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you so much for your support see you again in the next video bye bye